spider. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. The black cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? She wants me to find something. I need to look harder. There. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out. Hey, Yuri. You still have Black Cat's suit and equipment in the evidence lockup, right? I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were gonna meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter, I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Well, of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. Another camera. Gotta be Black Cat. Are you jealous I'm visiting my other man? I hope so. But you should know, bad boys aren't my type. Another cat. Why are you doing this, Felicia? You know I'm gonna catch you. Demons are out of control. Terror are gentlemen. That is not how an ATM works. That's not even an ATM. I should have recorded this. Gearing up for something big.
<sighs> Can't believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. Everyone feels hopeless at some point. Helps to know there's somebody willing to listen. What are you doing here so late? Hope May's couch is comfortable. So I was into horses. Wasn't everybody at some point? Wish May would take some of this down. It's embarrassing. I can't take this. You can and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this after- Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Want to join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. It's so humiliating taking money from May. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward. Another camera. Looks like Black Cat, all right. Oh, poor spider. I know I disappointed you when I couldn't go straight, but why mess with perfection? Found you. I think they sell rare wine here. She's branching out. Gotta try and get ahead of her. Another message from Doc. I don't want to jinx us, but the lead I'm following might not only get the project back on its feet, but also expand it in ways we never could have imagined. Everything happens for a reason, even Norman pulling our plug. Really hope this works out. Doc's work is too important to go unfinished.
snacky time. Howard, long time no see. How's Pidgey do? He's a little down today. Misses his cousins. Been a bit of a whirlwind for both of us. Owners of my building, rezoned for commercial. We had to move into feast to get our bearings. I'm so sorry. New York landlords can really be heartless. When they kicked me out of my place, they set all my birds loose. Pidgey's the only one who found me. I've been looking everywhere for the rest of them, but with my bad leg and all... You know what? I get around. How about I keep an eye out for him? You do that? Oh, thank you. If you have any luck, please give me a call. Hey, Jeff. Congrats on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed demons scares me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the Fisk construction site in Midtown. My wife would kill me if I ditched the ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by and let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what, just never mind. <laughs> Nothing like putting my skills to good use. Hey, Howard, I think I found one of Pidgey's cousins. Dusty Gray Flex, might have just left a stain on my suit? Clarence, guy's a little devil, <laughs> but he's a charmer. Uh, give him a pat on the head and point him towards me. He'll find his way. No problem. I'll do the same for any others I find. Sorry, spider emergency. Ha, <laughs> a pigeon. Oh, come back, little birdie. Pigeon alert! Oh, come back, little birdie! It is my responsibility to catch that pigeon. I can't believe I said that.
Pigeon target acquired. Don't run! I won't hurt you! Sandra? Oh, uh, my, my wife. Well, tell Sandra she's got some fine birds. Oh, uh, yeah. Sure we are, Spider-Man. Thanks again. And please, keep an eye out. Need backup for a vehicle pursuit in progress. Nearest officer, please proceed to Rosevale. Pigeon alert! Don't fly away, please! It's all over the news. Another battle between Spider-Man and these demon-masked gunmen threatening the lives of New Yorkers. I understand our next caller lives in the area. You're on, with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, um, the thing is, it all happened in a shipyard that's been closed for years. There weren't any innocent people in danger. Oh, is that your expert opinion? Well, let me tell you what I've learned from sources I developed in my award-winning journalism career. That shipyard was a front for Wilson Fisk. He's been using it to smuggle guns, grenades, military-grade ordnance. Oh, that explains a lot. Ah, the truth bomb strikes. But wait, here's a 50-megaton payload of fact. While Spider-Man tried to grab the glory for himself, chasing one truck. Another vehicle got away with an arsenal of deadly, illegal weapons. Fisk, for all his faults, would never have let them be used in this city. But these demons? Either they're some kind of fanatical cult, or they just don't care. Anybody feel like they're in danger now? Howard's Pigeon. And the chase is on. There's a pigeon, and the chase is on. This pigeon knows the city better than I do. Yeah, taking you home. 
buddy. Pigeon target acquired. Don't fly away, please! these names. Is Sandra happy to see them back? Well, uh, actually, she's not with us anymore. Cancer, you know. Howard, I'm so sorry. Oh, it's okay. Life's for living, not moping. First thing she told me after the diagnosis. Gotta remind myself of that every now and again. Keep looking, will you? Finding the rest of these birds would really mean a lot. Thanks, Spider-Man. MJ wrote this article in the school paper about student protests. She was a heck of a journalist even then. Hey. Uh, Magnifique! Reports of armed suspects show, mugging civilians. Me. Officers near Devil's like Shelf, please you. report to the scene. Excuse me. Get out of my neighborhood. Hi. Hey, you, trouble? you don't fool me. You ought to check that Oscorp like research station. I heard there's a rumor there's radioactive stuff in them. Appreciate the tip. Ooh, do the hand. We don't need you here right now, right? Excuse me, pardon me. Regards from the Kingpin. This 
Careful with my adoring public. 1080. Need immediate backup for a chase in progress. how much I love photography. Nearest officer, please proceed to Manhattanville. Pigeon target acquired. It's getting away. Looking good, Spidey. I wonder if pigeons eat spiders. Getting away. Is you really him? Can I get an autograph? Something's going down at the Fisk construction site. Gotta remember to check it out. Pigeon alert! Don't fly away, please! Hey, slow down! Man, I wish I spoke pigeon. Okay! Pigeon target acquired. Come on. It's a fast one.
Okay. Spider-Man, I can't believe it. Whole family's reunited. No sweat, Howard. These birds are lucky to have you. I try. Sandra was always better with them. They're her birds, really. And now that she's gone, they're yours. Feels like a part of her lives on that way, you know? I definitely know. You're a good man, Howard. Anytime you want to stop by and see the family, <laughs> feel free. Dad says he misses you. Thanks again, Spider-Man. Now, some people falsely say I make up stories about Spider-Man. And this will not help my case because it sounds outlandish, but I have personally seen listener-recorded video of Spider-Man snatching pigeons. Pigeon napping. Why? What possible purpose could there be for such aberrant behavior? I've thought about it long and hard, and I think I've figured it out. He's eating them. We've always assumed Spider-Man is a man with the attributes of a spider. But what if it's the reverse? What if somehow a spider gained the powers of a man? 
and he's stalking his prey. Somewhere, there's a giant web with these poor pigeons stuck in it, waiting to be devoured. And will it stop at pigeons? Will we be next? I promise you this. I will not rest until I have the answers. <laughs>